That's up. I'm, I'm pumped to get into the press conference. Uh, yeah. Eastern Michigan Eagles. We did it. We did it. Perfect red zone conversions here. 100% in the red zone. Zero turnovers. We scored. I don't even think. Yeah, we had maybe one punt that entire game. Oh, that's the Eagles that I want to see each and every game. Uh, I'm proud. I'm proud of all my players during this game. They've earned each and every yard for this whole season. We've had ups, we've had downs, but we we're able to convert when it when it really, really mattered. Oh, and oh, and we have some questions here from the reporters. Um, I have one, one, one in the back here. A question here: uh, What's the future hold for your future recruits, and why will your new halfback be the core of your team? <laughs> well, um, our new halfback, Eric Busambani, um, he's the top running back of the class coming in and he's a, he has already committed to Eastern Michigan University uh, coming forward this year. Uh, we're real proud to be having him in our program. Um, I believe Mario Stevens here. I believe he is a senior. So there's a chance that this get, that this uh, new kid on the block is going to be starting. Um, he's a nice power back. Uh, I'm real glad to, uh, real glad to uh, be able to utilize him in different packages that we haven't seen before. So, uh, yeah, even after our initial scouting, he was a whole lot faster than what we initially even recalled there. So, um, so yeah, real happy, real happy for this upcoming recruit recruit class. Um, nope, we have a, a reporter kind of on the uh, other side over here. Coach, how do you get a nice, such a nice shine on that head of you? Turtle wax by chance? No, that's uh, <laughs> we we have some uh, talented staff here at Eastern Michigan University that. That try to look over, you know, try to look over attire, hair, beard, and all. And um, th they're definitely putting in some overtime work this last time around here. So, um, yeah, they're really trying to get that nice glare off the side just enough so that, you know, if, uh, if a biker was passing by and you were, uh, you happen to be driving, that biker will not see you and they will get smashed. Uh, <laughs> and you know what I say? Jeff's balding, baby. Jeff's balding. That's the Jeff's balding effect. Oh, okay. We have a new reporter up here in front. Coach, coach, I heard that your brother said that he, uh, that he's the better looking one. Um, is that correct? Um, I strongly disagree. Uh, I strongly disagree that, that my brother is the, that is the better looking brother of the two of us. Um, he may have been born first, but he definitely got all the worst of the genes in terms of uh, in terms of good looks. Uh, he got he's got he got all the crappy genes. Um, you know, I clearly clearly have every gene except for the long hair gene. <laughs> so, all right, they have uh, allegations have been raised that you prefer Miracle Whip over Hellman's. What kind of animal are you? And can we expect your resignation? You know, I'm going to double down. I'm going to double down on the miracle whip. And I tell you what, each and every week, we give a miracle whip to whoever our opponents are. Yeah, LSU, miracle whip. Boom. Boom. That's what I got to say about that. Miracle whip all day. You, you, Hellman's, that, that's what Clemson likes. Hellman's likes Clemson. And nobody here likes Clemson. So, yeah. So at this point... <laughs> so at this point, you can think I'm a monster. You can think I'm a monster all you want. Um, yeah, get get out of your janitor. Get out of your janitor. <laughs> get out of here. <laughs> so get out of here. Um, I have no idea what she's talking about. No idea what Slice's talking about. <laughs> but yeah, yeah, we we played one hell of a game. We played one hell of a game, and that's for sure. Giving them the miracle whip <laughs> all day, each every day. So, yeah, looking real forward to this offseason. There's a few recruits we definitely want to take a look at, see if we can just add to this real good recruit class that we already have. Um, Illuminati confirmed. Um, yeah, and we're gonna we're gonna make sure that we keep this momentum going into the next season, and hopefully, national championship is gonna be on our mind. This I'll finally be at the point where. 
all of my initial freshmen um, will now be seniors. Will now be seniors here. We have a couple, you know, a couple new really good additions as far as recruits go to to join the mix here. So this is a full balding team. So, um, I do have a question over here, Coach. Coach, do you miracle whip, whip, and then you nay nay? <laughs> you know, I may may. <laughs> if that's yeah. oh dad jokes <laughs> dad jokes <laughs> oh yeah we got that miracle whip whip the nay nay got you for sure it also got lsu <laughs> we said nay nay for their ball game <laughs> Oh, so real proud, real proud of this one right here. Um, yeah, sit down. Um, yeah, you got Yeah, sit down, LSU. We're moving on to the off season here. I thank you all for coming out and participating in the press conference today. Um, I appreciate you all. Go Eastern Michigan University. Go Bow Game Champions. Go Emus. <laughs>